this just in, time now for what <laughs> some consider, some meaning us, one of the most amazing segments in all of morning television. It's our weekly trip under the radar. First up, a record-setting skydive three miles above Poland. Of all the places to skydive, three miles above Poland, 104 daredevils took the plunge, jumping out of five different planes, breaking the European record for most skydivers in formation. I could have sworn the record was 107, but okay, I'll have to go back and check my facts. Previously held by a group of 99 skydivers. And Good from the air to the fair, the Wisconsin State Fair for the annual Moo yeah, La Palooza, Moo, the uh, important term there. It's a contest after 74 wannabes tried their best to sound like a real cow, came down to the final four. Take a listen. Good. Good. The winner of the moo off is a 10 year old named Austin who took home a thousand bucks in cash, a cow print jacket and a trophy that should put him in a good mood. He got a cow print jacket. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. And ouch. This just in. The, the international yo-yo community has a new champion. This is something we've been looking forward to all week. Congratulations to Canadian Jensen Kimmett, who was crowned winner of the single yo-yo division in Orlando. The World Yo-Yo Competition has been held since 1932 to, quote, support and cultivate the development mm. of a world yo-yoing community. It's very important. <laughs> that is their mantra. It's on their <laughs> business cards. Sounds like fun, but if you're looking for a new career, look elsewhere. First prize for each division is a mere 2000 bucks. Now, it says a mere $2,000, but I think that's I'm actually... I'm going to learn. That's actually not too bad if you're just there to yo-yo. Can you? Yeah. Get uh, try it real quick. Okay. Give it a shot. I'm going to try, you but it's seconds. really... Okay. You got... Okay. I haven't done this in about nine years. <laughs> stick to Wall Street. Okay.